Hello everyone, my name is Archer and welcome back to another video. Today I'm showing you guys how to install LSPFR Radio Animations and Pursuit Status Reporting in brackets more realism mod to your LSPFR. That was a mouthful of a, a title for a episode, so I'm probably going to call it LSPFR Radio Animations. But to install this mod, all you guys are going to want to do is click the first download link down in the description below and then head down to here where it says download this file, hit download, agree and download, and then click here. Then what you guys are going to do, you're going to open up the download. For some reason, Windows 11 always gives me this little notification for some reason. Grab the download, and right here, you should be able to see a LSPDFR and plugins folder. But before we go any further, I never used to do this, but I'm going to have to start doing this. If you guys haven't already subscribed, please, please be sure to subscribe. It literally takes five seconds of your time, and literally, I think only like 17% of you guys are subscribed to watch my videos. So please, please be sure to subscribe since it really, really helps me out. And I do want to hit maybe 2.5k by the end of the year. That would be absolutely incredible. So if you guys could help me out with that, thank you guys very, very much. But to carry on with the video, all you guys want to do is get these two folders and put them into your GTA 5 folder. So it's very, very simple. But obviously there are a couple of requirements like your basic LSPDFR, your Rage plugin hook, and your script hook V. So to do this, all you guys going to want to do is open up your gta5 main directory in your file explorer those of you guys on steam i'm going to show you guys how to get to your game right now but for those of you guys on epic games and rockstar games i'm going to leave your gta5 main directory down in the description below like usual but all you guys are going to want to do for steam is go to whatever drive you install your game on so for me that is going to be my i believe my c drive and then all you guys are going to want to do is go to program files 86 go to steam steam apps and then comment and choose a GTA 5 folder you want to mod. But because I chose a custom directory and none of you guys normally have a custom directory, mine is going to be under here. But for those of you guys who don't have a custom directory, that is going to be your GTA 5 main directory. But once you've got your GTA 5 main directory, all you guys are going to want to do is grab both of these files right here and simply drag and drop them into your GTA 5 into a blank space around here, making sure that you are not drag and dropping them into another folder by mistake. Drag and drop them in. And then all you guys are going to want to do is go into plugins. And then you guys should be able to see if you go into LSPDFR, you should be able to see that the plugins are now successfully installed in your GTA 5. So right here you have a DLL, a PDB. For some reason, you do not have a config, probably because you don't even have to actually configure anything, which is really, really nice. So you can hop right in the game and you guys can see what it is about. And also, if you go into your LSPDFR folder, Basically, all that guys would have done is added your audio scanning folders because basically, if you guys do not know what this mod does, it pretty much enhances your GTA 5 so you can get way more realism. It's a really, really cool mod and I use this all the time in my videos if you guys haven't noticed. But here are all of the included features. And if you guys do want to see what this does in the game, you can head down right here and you can look at the showcase since it saves my time and it'll save your time as well. So all you guys are going to want to do is to see what it does is go on to the download link down in the description below. Go right to the bottom and look at the showcase this guy has attached. But other than that, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Be sure to check out my Discord server down in the description below. Be sure to like, comment and subscribe. Like I said in the beginning, only 17% 17 of you guys are subscribed. 75 would be awesome. See if we can get there maybe by the end of like 2025. That would be crazy. So thank you guys very, very much for watching this video. And I'll see all of you guys in the next one. Cheers and goodbye.